The Sustainable Construction Zone, a YouTube learning channel, presents No, it's not a type of music genre. This is SCAR Rating, a green building certification scheme. We know that 18% of UK carbon emissions are from existing building stock. Existing green building ratings did not serve fit-out and refurbishment projects very well. And 97% of existing buildings worldwide did not have any certification. So, in 2009, SCAR Rating was created. SCAR Rating is an environmental assessment method for fit-out and refurbishment projects. It's owned, led and regulated by the RICS, who undergo third-party auditing. It's an informal web-based assessment, which can lead to a gold, silver, or bronze award, if assessed by a qualified SCAR assessor. SCAR principles have evolved over time, to incorporate best practices. The use of SCAR drives effort to conserve and reuse resources throughout the life cycle, reduce and eliminate pollution, increase and drive occupant well-being, improve the available data for reporting, reduce running costs, and ultimately deliver further environmental improvements. The SCAR assessment process is in two stages, the first of which is design. There is a second stage assessment at handover. There are 109 good practice measures for offices, 112 for retail and 131 for higher education. A rating can be awarded, based on the number of measures achieved at handover stage. There is also an option to review how well a fit-out has performed, a year after completion. Because each fit-out project is unique, a scoping exercise allows the SCAR rating to be tailored to the project. The project is only assessed against relevant good practice measures. Typically there may be around 30 to 60 measures. Some measures are mandatory, whereas others could be scoped out. Some measures are more important from a sustainability perspective, so the measures are ranked from 1 to 104, 1 is the highest and 104 the lowest. To ensure that teams do not just target the easiest measures, the project has to achieve a number of the highest ranked measures in scope in order to score. These are known as gateway measures. SCAR assessments can be undertaken by anyone, using the online tool at this address. Anyone can use the free online SCAR rating tool, to informally evaluate a project. Certification can be achieved by engaging a SCAR assessor, to rate and certify the project. The RICS accredit assessors to undertake SCAR rating assessments on behalf of organizations. A list of assessors can be found on the RICS website. RICS charges a small fee for each certification the assessor carries out. A typical assessment and certification may cost a few thousand pounds. So that's a quick overview of SCAR rating. Thanks for watching. See you next time.